Okay, module 5 is about first law of thermodynamics and we will cover the energy balance. The cause outcome for this model is the ability to acquire and explain the basic concepts in thermodynamics. Okay, so by the end of the chapter, students should be able to state the first law of thermodynamics and identify uh, the statement uh, of the conservation of energy. Explain the mechanisms of energy transfer for a closed system and write down the energy balances for a closed system. So the contents that we will cover for this model is about the first law of the model mix, and general energy balance and energy balance for closed systems. So what does it mean by first law of the model mix? Okay, the first law of the model mix is actually the conservation of energy principle, which provides a sound basis for studying the relationships among the various forms of energy and energy interactions. Okay, so this is the definition. The first law of the modern mix states that energy can be neither created nor destroyed during a process. It can only change forms. Okay, so it can't it, it uh, apa, uh it can't be destroyed during process and uh, it can it cannot be created as well. It only can change forms. Eh? So the first law for all uh, adiabatic processes between two specified states of a closed system, the network done is the same regardless. Of the nature of the closed system and the details of the process. So look at the example from here. So this is state number one. This is state number two. So when the rock uh, drop from state number one to state uh, uh, state number two, so what happened is uh, uh, at state number one we have the value of potential energy which is ten kilojoule. Okay, and because we have level, we have a high uh, at here. Okay. But we don't have kinetic energy yet, okay, because it's not in motion yet, okay. So the kinetic energy is equal to zero for at state number one, okay. When it's dropped down, okay, at state number two, potential energy is decreasing, okay, decreasing, uh, uh from ten to seven kilojoule, and we uh, we have started to have uh, kinetic energy value which is a uh, three kilojoule because it is in motion, okay. Uh, so this is state number one, state number two. So uh, if we have state number three, uh, when it reach down, okay, state number three, so the potential energy will be zero because the height is already zero. We don't have height anymore, okay. But uh, and the kinetic energy is also equals to zero, okay, because uh, we don't have motion anymore, okay. So this shows that energy cannot be created or destroyed. It can it can only change form. So in this case, potential energy has changed into kinetic energy. Okay, this uh, this is uh, the total of the energy just now is ten kilojoule, uh, and at state number two, it is a combination of potential energy and kinetic energy. So some of the energy from potential energy has been changed into kinetic energy. So that's what does it mean? Okay, so the same goes for this one. The increase in the energy of a potato in an oven is equal to the amount of heat transferred to it. So when you, uh, when you supply heat, uh, Q in equals to five kilojoules. So, uh, the changes of uh energy that has been received by the potato is also five kilojoules. Okay. So this these are another uh. Uh, examples for this uh, for uh, first law of thermodynamics eh? in the absence of any work interactions the energy change of the system is equal to the net heat transfer so when you supply q in 15 kilojoule okay so uh, uh, delta e is equal to the q net is equal to 12 why because uh, q net equals to uh, q in Minus Q out, 3 kilojoule. So, you will get Q net equals to 12 kilojoule. Okay. So, uh, this one is the electrical energy. The work electrical done on an adiabatic system is equal to the increase in the energy of the system. So, work in that has been supplied is 5 kilojoule. Okay. So, actually, the, the, the delta E is equal to 5 kilojoule because you have received 5 kilojoule of energy. Okay. So this one is the shaft. Okay, the work 
shaft done on an adaptive system is equal to the increase in the energy of the system. Okay, the, this is the increment of energy. So you have supplied work of 8 kilojoule. So the, the changes of energy is also equals to 8 kilojoule. 